right, so out here today it's raining out. Uh, I got this Kings County Camp Axe not too long ago. I have yet to get a chance to use it, but I uh, figured today's a perfect day to give it a little uh, test run uh, in the garage. I'll, uh, you know, run it through a couple tests, cut some stuff split some stuff see what see how it goes <clears throat> so I got a couple chunks of wood right here we'll see how how she does the wood First things first, we'll get this uh, get this rubber off. Now, looks like it's a decently well done axe. Uh, you know the uh, front of the bit does look like they hardened it. Um, Definitely looks like it's got a little bit of an artistic aspect to it, but I'm hoping that it actually hoping it actually performs well. Feels feels like it's a feels pretty uh legit but let's see uh, I'm gonna start see how sharp it is see if it can can actually uh, shave some wood mm -hmm. not bad Definitely could be sharper. Feels like it could be touched up a little bit. Yeah, it feels like there's definitely a burr on it, but straight out of the box, not bad sharpness wise. I kind of fucked that one up, but. It could be thinner, but definitely like the weight to it, though. Good feel. All right, let's give it a little little chop test. See if we can make some kindling. like it. It's definitely a little naughty, but... Not bad. Oh, 
<laughs> I probably picked the hardest fucking wood I could have. Definitely not bad. This wood's really hard. I'll we'll see if a uh, little abuse it. This wood's really uh, picked probably the toughest wood I could find. Uh, still fairly sharp. So, uh, in conclusion, seems like a pretty good camp axe, uh, not too bad, it's a great weight in my opinion, uh, like the shape, the size, it's a great pack axe, uh, stays fairly sharp it seems, uh, but I'll have to put it to a little more use, um, says it's made in Germany so US Hickory seems like a pretty legit little axe not too expensive either I think I paid like 40 bucks for it so 